And a chief executive officer of the Ghana Tourism Authority, as GTA Akwesi Ajima, is saying the bus for the city tour is undergoing local customization to provide comfort to passengers. And the commercial aspect of the city tour is to commence on July 15. The chief executive officer of the Ghana Tourism Authority, Akwesi Ajimai, responded to allegations on the use of an unsuitable bus. Any open deck bus will leak if it rains. But the idea is not to leave it open. So we've picked out lessons from other countries. I mean, if you go to Barcelona, if you go to Dubai, even in London, the hop-in, hop-out buses. What they do is that you fix, you improvise or you fix uh, some system which in good weather is open. When it's raining, then you can pull. So the bus didn't come as an open top. It came covered. It has to be customized locally. And so that customization is what is being done. He gave a hint of plans to procure more buses to boost domestic tourism. The whole idea was to start with one bus and see how the response and reaction is. And then we can look at others and also other regions. He revealed that strategies are being adopted to ensure the bus achieves its intended purpose. We're going to put out a, a platform so you book online and then once it's full, it's full. It's not like you're coming to queue to board. You book, if it's five people, the tour will move. So it's a, it's a fixed scheduled tour and that is what we are doing. My anticipation is that by the 15th of July, we should start our first commercial tours. Meanwhile, the tour operators of Ghana has signed a memorandum of understanding with the authority to use the open tour bus as one of the key promotional tools for city tours.